I discovered the danceability method, which is an approach to dance education that's been around for 30 years. This method is based in dance improvisation and it's designed to effectively include all people. I have to acknowledge that this method is something that was developed by a man named Alito Olesi. He's the, my teacher. We're the first group to be bringing danceability to Maine. For people with disabilities, the, the dance world can seem somewhat elitist. Here, everyone's offering is equal. And you don't have to worry about what you may look like in your chair. You can just come and enjoy yourself. I think that the danceability method gives people permission to value their own dance. And I think fundamentally that comes down to not being isolated because we feel valued in a group. Through the process, through the experience of the class, I get to witness this discovery that they are a dancer, in fact, already, that that's already, that's, that's inside them. Even in our first, our first year of programming, there has been tremendous interest. You know, a lot of times when I approach different organizations who serve people with disabilities, the response is usually, yes, we need this, we want this, we want more things that are inclusive. If you want to be part of this, you're at the beginning of something really special. And so now it's the time to get in on the ground floor and really help this movement grow. Because what we have to offer is completely unique, completely accessible, and absolutely beautiful and uplifting and enriching.